Good day, welcome to Unity with Heaven. My name is Joseph, and today I am with Elisma, and we're going to minister to 10 people. If you would also like to receive ministry, write your name in the comments, and we would love to minister to you. So the first person I want to minister to is Kath Wilson. Kath, the Lord shows me how He brings unity in your family. And the Lord says, I want to move you to the next level. I want to open up a door. But the door is not just for you as a person. It's for you as the whole family. So the Lord says, as you reconcile, you come in unity, you love one another, you give gifts to one another, then the Lord will open up the door and He will promote and bless the whole family. God bless you, Kath. Amen. Next word is for wisdom. Um, Rivers, I see that there, there um, is a door and you're going through the door and there's so much light and life when you when you enter through the new season that you're moving in. And, and God says almost like, but you have to leave your past behind. You have to leave things behind. There's, there's um, people in your life that you have to almost like um, just cut out of your life so that you can move into your next season. And then I see there's so many blessings and there's so much um, spiritual growth when you move forward into this place that God has placed you and I really feel that God wants to move in your heart and 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 and, and heal you from inner inner wounds and bless you okay okay wisdom uh, God bless you uh, wisdom the, the Lord has given you an anointing uh, but he wants you to say I'm available yes. okay God bless you all right so now Edgar Edgar the Lord shows me three arrows three years three chances and I felt the previous three years, it was seasonal. Every year he gave you an arrow. And just, just like the farmer would take the harvest off the, the field once a year, so the year gave you a chance and an arrow. But now I see 12 arrows and 12 months. And I felt that the Lord says he's going to change the, the frequency of how you receive blessing from God. And he's giving you 12 months, 12 arrows, 12 chances, uh, 12... Um, breakthroughs and so that's so i felt 2025 is going to be different than the previous three years so the lord is going to every month bless you god bless you i mean the next word is for lisa um i see you you on a track and you're going but wherever you're going there's a light underneath your feet and and you can see wherever you're going but it's around you it's dark but when you move there's a light and it's almost like god is saying to you that this that is the light of him that you are carrying inside of you and the, you make such a difference in your family's life you make such a difference in people's lives with, with whatever you are carrying inside with what that love that you are carrying inside the love of jesus that you carry so keep on doing that keep on moving so that people can see jesus through you and don't get discouraged when people think you are different than other people be because you make a difference when you meet people and when you speak to people be blessed hey eliza god bless you uh, strength strength and healing for you um you, you you're not frail the lord is strengthening you uh, so the next word is for jane all uh, right so jane the lord shows me bread that you have received like a few times that the lord just supernaturally provided for you but the bread didn't have anything on and then i see how the lord now puts on you know mayo and some cheese and tomato and meat and things like that he puts toppings on top of your bread and now you eat it and i felt that the lord says there's going to be an overflow in your life the lord is giving you sweetness for a good year but that overflow is meant for you and for uh, the blessing of the people all around you in your family your friends and even in your congregation god bless you jane i mean Amani, i see a red red button and and as you're trying to you it's almost like you want to pick up the button but the button is glued on on a, a, a piece of paper and then god says you need to look further don't just focus on the red button you need to, you need to look further because when you look further there will be more other you know more things to choose from it's almost like you are focused on one thing but god wants to bless you with more he wants to show you more things and then when you look up it's almost like the paper enlarges and there are a, a, like a million buttons but of different colors so, so it's like God wants to tell you that he wants to give you more spiritual um, uh, uh, giftings and but you need to you need to stand in that and say thank you Lord I am a child of God and I want to receive these spiritual blessings so that you can grow in every area and I really feel that God has placed a um, intercessor anointing upon you but he also wants you to move in the in the prophetic be blessed yeah mariana uh, god loves you uh, oh, many here god loves you uh, hey mariana um uh, the, the lord shows me a position an uh, office that he gives to you uh, mariana and uh, you were called mariana and then you were called 
Mrs. Bueta. So it's like a official a place of authority, a place of honor. And I felt that the Lord says you've been faithful and he's promoting you and he's giving you the office. Now in the church we have the apostle and the prophet and the teacher, and the evangelist and the pastor. Uh, but there is also administrative offices that God gives people. And I feel that the Lord says, I'm giving you an office, a position of authority. God bless you. I mean, next word is for Tebogo. Tebogo, I see you sitting in, in, a, in a building or like in a room and you're holding a, a lady's hand, but it, it's a family member's hand. It's either your mother or your wife or your daughter um, that you are holding hands with. And it's, uh, God says he's going to restore unity between you. And as you take um, the woman's hands, the, the room starts spinning around and there's so much joy and there's laughter. And then God just brings restoration, restoration, restoration. So whatever hurt there's been between you and this woman, whatever, you know, whatever the enemy came, because he, he doesn't want us to have unity, especially with family and especially um, with if it's your wife. So God wants to restore that unity so that um, because where two or more is there, the Lord will be. And it's almost like he says you need to pray with this woman so that God's presence can be um, more in your household and that's going to change the things around you and um, because you also be, you are asking for a breakthrough in your family and, and this will bring that breakthrough. Yeah, I mean the Bojo, I agree. Breakthrough for you and your family. Okay, so Joe, I, I see your whole family all standing in a circle, all looking inwardly and now the Lord is turning each one to face outwardly. Then the Lord showed me the point of a spear and the Lord says you are the point of the spear to go into darkness to bring light uh, to do evangelism to heal the sick and to bring restoration to the poor and the Lord is opening up ways for you how you can minister in your community and how you can help and share and then the Lord says as you are obedient to me and you are used by the Lord then the Lord in return comes again and he yields and he restores your family and I, I see your I see more arrows and it could be your children uh, it could even be your husband that the Lord then adds to the ministry and say but if, if when you also make yourself available and obedient to the Lord to serve and to minister to others and even the ones that are struggling then I will in return come and I'll restore all of those bro that brokenness in your family again god bless you joe i mean next word is for ron ron i see you are on this long it's almost like a train and you're alone on this train and but it's an unusual train it almost looks it's, it's just a very unusual train and you feel like but this is you're not used to this and it's out of your comfort zone and as you continue it's almost like god is building um, pieces of of different characters in a uh, character um it's like character building in your life and then as you go on, more people get on the train, more people get on the train. And it's definitely um, a, a ministry type of train where you collect people for God and then you build a strong ministry. But first you're going to be, um, it's almost like you're going to feel alone. You're going to be secluded where God is going to speak to you. He's going to strengthen you and then you're going to build more. And mm. then people are going to get on this train and it's, it's going to become a, a strong um ministry for the Lord. Be blessed. Yes. Um, I just want to just speak a, a corporate word because I feel that word is coming through in each one uh, of the the people whose names are on the list and I think for you when you listen even if your name is not on the list it's a corporate word that the Lord is speaking about um, ministering to other people to rise up in the ministry that God has for you and in the process the Lord then takes care of your concerns in your life all right and so sometimes god does that he wants us to focus on what he wants and then he takes care of the things that affects us again and i feel that is a corporate word uh, for all of us uh, sometimes we can so focus on what we think the problem is and then nothing gets resolved uh, but when we get out of the way and we do what god wants us to do then he can come in he can intervene and he can restore us all right the lord loves each one of you it was a, a blessing for me and Elisma to minister to you. Remember to write your name in the comments if you'd like to receive ministry in this format. God bless you. Thank you for joining Unity with Heaven. Remember to subscribe, like, comment and join our newsletter. If you want to support us, please click on the PayPal link. May God bless you abundantly. Remember, you are valuable 
and we love and appreciate each one of you. If you enjoyed this content and you want to see more, please click here.